and welcome back to my channel. I am sat on the floor today <laughs> um, because I've got a bit of a different unboxing today and when the box arrived it was bloody huge. Um, so I thought the best thing to do was just sit on the floor because then I can actually manage it a bit better. So I'll just I'll get that box. So this here in all its bloody big glory <clears throat> is the box <laughs> and this is a box from Cotton On but more specifically their Typo brand so oh let me put that down you've probably had a Typo Typo are an amazing Australian stationery brand and lifestyle brand um and they had some mystery boxes at the moment so I thought why not I bought one for me one for my boyfriend but I'm gonna open them both here on the channel um and then he gets to see his afterwards um when he's back home from work so you can see why i'm sat on the floor now um i just thought it'd be really really fun i love mystery boxes i love typo and they're really big really really good bargains for you know me <laughs> so yeah i'm gonna grab some scissors because i forgot to get those and then we're gonna get on into it yeah my rug's got pom-pom tassels that kind of like poking my bum and it's a bit uncomfortable but i can't be asked to remove my rug so you know I can already see things outside of like the mystery boxes so hopefully is it all just kind of it does look like it's all kind of just lobbed in here together as opposed to like being in individual like boxes but big thing in paper number one big thing in paper number two oh my god big thing in paper number three <gasps> Okay, so this is going to be like one massive sort of unboxing. Uh, let me have a look. Um, okay, so I'm not entirely sure what belongs to watch box. So we're just going to open it as if it's one massive mystery box, which is like self-care and like all the swear words, basically. Um, so the first thing I can see is this cushion. And it's a Gerber's cushion! <gasps> Oh my god! Oh my god, I love this! Look at that, that is amazing! Oh my gosh! <laughs> okay, let's go with a bit of a smaller one this time. And we got some more Care Bear stuff, so let's stick with that. And it is a load of Care Bears stickers, which are all self-care bears. So I get the feeling that my self-care box is very much Care Bear themed, and I am here for it. <laughs> um, nostalgia. Oh my God, this is amazing. I love these. Oh my God. So these are usually £2. I can see that. Does this one have a price on it? How much it usually is? pounds oh my god right we've got socks we've got socks so we have got some tie-dye care bear socks we have got some nice just grid print socks which are really cute and i think these ones are from what should have been dominic's box uh because it says have a fucking nice day it's got a little censored by typo thing there that's amazing i love those although i will be i'll be stealing these ones you know um because mainly because you know they're in my size and not his so he could have these ones because they're in i think they're in his size um but these two are for me now. <laughs> so yeah, these would each have been six pounds each. So that's 18 pounds worth of socks right there. Um, ah, let's go for this one. Oh my God, so, oh, I like that. I actually do like that. We have got a big ass frame and it says optimistic, always optimistic, which I quite like. I do like that. Oh my gosh. And this would have been 12 pounds um and just a little bit of information on the back about it so it's a typo gallery artist series a4 framed print um it's a birchwood color frame designed in-house by australian artists hooks on the back for hanging can remove artwork and insert own 
I really like that. That's really cool. And I like that, you know, I can just pop in my own artwork if I wanted to. If I had any artwork, I don't, but need to try and find somewhere for this to live now. Hmm. Ooh. So, next up, we have got, oh, we got a little notebook. Oh no, oh no, it's not a notebook. It looks like it is a your beauty makeup and self-care guide. It's a self-care, the beauty edit book. And it is like an activity journal. Oh, it is an activity journal. Oh, nice. I like that. So it's got like a self-care log, skincare review, makeup review. That's really sweet. I do like that. That is really, really nice. And this would also be six pounds usually. Nice. Let's dive in again. <laughs> okay, so this is another one that would have been Dominic's. It's a bit dirty. I can see why this has been put in a mystery box but you know it's, it's not a big big deal um it's just been maybe trodden on a couple of times uh but it says calm as fuck and it is a pretty big sticker which would normally be two pounds um it's quite cute and again it's got one of those censored by typo things um so the parents don't moan in the store sort of thing but i might be able to get some of this grub off of here um just looks like it's been trodden on a couple of times but you know it is cute so now we have got a candle and it says fabulous bitch on it and it's meant to be a coconut vanilla and it is a soy wax candle i think this is a pillar oh my god it does smell very coconutty and it's going to be a brown one because it says wax color same as paper color so that's really really cool I've been burning a typo candle recently. I do have another typo candle, which actually I'll show you because it's amazing. I'm going to go show you. And it fits with the vibe of this. Oh, oh, this one would also be six pounds usually. So <laughs> last time we visited a typo store, we bought a load of bits. Um, and one of the things is this, and this is a candle and it says it's a vibe and this little candle dish, which is really cute. And we're never going to burn it. It's so <laughs> It's too cute. Um, so yeah, I'll go put that back before I drop it again. And ooh, back to resume usual programming. Um, so that candle is really, really cool. I like that. And it smells really, really nice. Uh, let's go for this. We got a bottle. Um, it doesn't appear to say anything on it. It's just a really nice water bottle by the looks of it. Um, and it's got like, oh no it does, it says bottoms up, you've got this halfway there, a little bit more. And this is total fucking legend at the bottom. That is brilliant. I'm sure Dominic will love that for work. And it's black. Um, and his soul is black, as you could have gathered from that candle. So this one would have been £7 usually. We do have another bottle. And I think this is my bottle, <laughs> which is actually really cute as well. Oh no, it isn't. It says fabulous bitch. Um, so it could be mine. But I like that. I like being a fabulous bitch. And it's got a floral design. I'm not taking it out of the bag yet. Um, just in case there's anything Dominic doesn't necessarily want or, you know, we gift onto other people. Um, but it's worn with £7 usually, as was the other one. I don't know if I said that or not. But yeah, pink like me. <laughs> Then we've got a notebook here, which would have been £2.50, which says, fuck, hate, spread, peace, which I think is quite cute. Um, always do with a notebook. And this is quite a sweet one. Um, and I like that it's not massive either. And it's got like a little holder for like bits and bobs in the front. And it's just lined and it's got margins. And yeah, it's quite useful, I guess. Stationery can always be useful. And this is quite a small one, so it's quite easy to put in a bag or something, you know. Um, if I was going back to uni this year, that would be brilliant. If, but I'm not, um, so I use it for something. <laughs> yeah. Then we have got how to use profanities and not offend anyone. An informative guide to swearing. Politely. Um, and again, it's just another notebook. Um which is always very, very useful. I like that this just looks very subtle, you know? So yeah, I like that a lot. Um, and this one would have been £3.50. So their notebooks are really actually quite affordable, which a lot of these type stationery stores, their notebooks are just stupidly priced. Um, 
so yeah and then we have got got a pen this pen would have been £3.50 and <laughs> if you can see it's swearing at you <laughs> oh I like that that's cool uh, it is open so I'm gonna take it out and just that is really really cool um yeah Dom is gonna have to take that to work and see if he can get away with it I used to have a typo pen which was like a load of french fries on top and it was one of my favorite pens so this might be stolen just because I love the pens you know we still got more oh my god we got four more items so this item is another one of the coconut candles so that's really really cool we have then got oh we got a mug we have got a mug let's see oh no that's not good so unfortunately the mug hasn't made it it is broken it is a super super adorable mug i will email customer services and see if they can get another one sent out um because that is bloody adorable but let's see if the other mug survived because i think there might be another one in here so this mug has survived um oh i love this this is again from the sweary box and it say, says say la fucking v and it is really nice it's quite like a matte sort of feel um and it is dishwasher safe microwave safe which is really really cool I really want my yellow one not to be broken <laughs> um but yeah that's really really nice and would be five pounds usually Dom will be happy with that <laughs> and we're on to our last item which is a hard work candle it smells like I'm not doing it and it is coconut and lime scented let's have a look at this then <gasps> oh nice this is what it looks like. I was actually going to buy this one a few months ago. Let's see if I can get into it without breaking it. There we go. It smells like feet. Don't like the smell of that at all. Um, but that's fine because the jar is really, really cute. So I will be keeping the jar once I burn it through this feet smelling kind of, oh, that's horrible. That is really nasty. I don't know if I might just can I see that could just come out and not be burnt in the jar um I don't like the smell of that at all no um but yeah that that was everything in my typo box I'm really really happy I'm obviously a little bit sad about my yellow mug but I will email customer services and see if they can get another one sent out um that isn't broken because i do love that um but yeah oh my god it was such a good mystery box so if i was to pick a favorite item it's the care bear cushion it's so cuddly and soft um uh if i was to pick a least favorite um, probably have to be this sticker uh just because it's like dirty but i will be able to get the crap off of it it just i don't know just not the best and i don't know what to do with it i might just put it at the top of the mirror or something actually that'd be cute top of the mirror oh yeah um but yeah thank you so much for watching um i hope you've enjoyed this video i am going to be doing some slightly different videos in the future um i do have my latest small business buys coming up for the month of september but i'm also going to be doing like monthly vlogs now just kind of showing you what i'm up to because i am doing freelance stuff and it's fun and yeah and i'm hoping it will also push me to go out and do things on my own because at the moment i live at home and I don't leave my home. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's coming up. But if you like
like this kind of video let me know and i will try and do more like this in the future because i really freaking enjoyed this um so yeah <gasps> make sure you give it a thumbs up click that subscribe button and i'll see you again soon bye, -bye.